What's up guys? I'm Sean Casey, DNA Firearm Systems. Showing you guys a model that we've recently just released. This is the 75 Ti Carbon Tactical. Um, yeah, this thing's pretty sweet. Extremely, extremely lightweight. This has got our 75 Ti action, it's a titanium action. 75 degree bolt throw, really nice setup. Um, we team it up with a proof research blank. This one is 22 inches, six millimeter Creedmoor, which has got done chambering it. We also offer Cerakote in the ends of the proof barrel. That's always a nice accent to most rifles. Um, this one's a seven and a half twist. Uh, throw it for the heavies. Um, set it in this MDT chassis. We do some modifications, some alterations with it. Uh, our biggest thing that we target is having uh, a very stiff forehead, especially for the guys such as this customer who's going to be running clip on night vision or thermal optics. Uh, mounting to this night vision hood, it's critical that we have as little deflection as possible, therefore, less collimation shift. We're trying to eliminate collimation shift. Collimation shift and POI shift are two totally different things. Collimation shift obviously affects POI. Two different things just want to make that clear um but this is a super super nice build um we we uh, advertise this with the trigger tech special in it diamond is always uh, available as well no need to really go to a diamond in my opinion in a hunting rifle um, these trigger tech specials go down to one pound single stage nice clean break you really don't need to go much lighter than that for hunting um, folding stock is also an option. It does fold to 90 degrees, which makes a nice, quick way to set your gun up without laying it on its side. If you're out in the field, you hit the button again, and it folds on around. Very nice setup. You press the top release, and it's pretty tight. Very much playing it at all. Um, and this is the fixed stock version. It does come with shims if you need a longer length of pull, adjustable cheek tone, and another option for an extra 50 bucks. I don't know why you wouldn't do it, but Integral Arca Swiss in a carbon fiber foreign. I am very impressed actually with how they did this. Um, that one's kind of got me clueless, but I can tell you I've been running one of these for quite a while now. And the Arca Swiss, a lot of guys are probably wondering how it holds up being carbon fiber. I have not had any issues. Um, so with that being said, nice setup. Like I said, this rifle maps out obviously without the custom Cerakote. 4990, I believe is map on. And that's with the modifications to the foreign that we do. And, it, and as you see a button black, then if you want to do the folding stock option, it's another 200 bucks. Integral Arbor Swiss, another 50 bucks. Cerakoted ends on the barrel, 75 bucks. Uh, pretty simple. Very, very nice rifle. Uh, mag release is really nice and convenient right here. AICS uh, magazines is what this takes. And a super smooth titanium mag. I'm very, very proud of. Let's see what this thing's gonna weigh out at. Once again, Sendero Contour, 22 inch barrel, six millimeter Creedmoor, with the folding stock, take a this is 75 Ti Carbon Tactical, and it's gonna come in at six pounds, six, six pounds on the money, 6.04, 6.04, that's, that's super light, super light. Feels great. Balances very well. Time to put a suppressor on there. Your balance point will be up here, which will be about perfect. And put the bipod on there just as a reference.
Now speaking about the chassis a little bit more, just want to touch on a couple things here. They did a great job on designing and engineering the ergonomics of it. Uh, you'll notice it's got some shelves right here on each corner. Each edge, that's a nice ambidextrous. It makes it a really nice thumb shelf. Super comfortable. Triggers at 90 degrees naturally, which is what you want in precision shooting. Thank you, Andy Slade, for teaching me that. 90 degrees. Um, another thing about this, so chassis are really known they're known to be a little twingy when you shoot them twingy uh, versus like a conventional style stock, which really insulates recoil very well. I'm gonna say upon this specific chassis, it's carbon fiber up front, magnesium in the middle, carbon fiber in the rear. This is foam filled with carbon fiber. And recoil works off of frequencies, uh, wavelengths and so forth. Each one of these materials have different frequencies to where they are out of balance or harmonic. And then they got these frequencies where they insulate different recoil impulses better. And I believe the combination of these materials is a pretty darn good fit. I mean, when you shoot these rifles with this chassis, it's really, it's got a nice solid thud to it. It's not uh, twangy at all, you know. Ting, ting. It's a nice solid thud. Um, I'm really impressed at how it does absorbing recoil, honestly, for how light it is. Um, but what it comes down to is the material makeup that helps it do this. Um, like I said, then, it's a nice setup, man. Knock it out of the park. Um, so if any of you guys are interested, or well, got any further questions, and uh, feel free to give us a call. Phone number is 937-207-2025. I can't ever remember the shop number. It's somewhere. If you call it, that one's kind of hit and miss. But you're welcome to call myself. Phone number again, 937-207-2025, or you shoot us an email, sales at DNA Firearm Systems. Com. Let's get you one of these 75 TI carbon tacticals in your hand.